Ponce is there at that location, and it's no accident. Anthony. Not at all. Donna and Corey, if you have been on an uh, inbound flight to O'Hare from off of Lake Michigan over the last few days, you may have seen this display. If you happen to, happen to have a window seat and look down, a big message on the field just south of Montrose Harbor, uh, written in thousands of flags. These run, there are eight letters, they run about the length of a full-length soccer field. Each one of these flags representing, though, a heartbreaking reality for many Iranian citizens. We just want everyone to know we want a free Iran. Those two words, free Iran, written with 15,000 flags, each one representing an Iranian citizen wrongly detained or killed by the current regime. There are students, activists, artists, athletes. Um, just, they, they just have one message. They had one need. They want to fight for justice and their simple human rights that being um, taken away from them. Latifi says Iranians are being imprisoned and in some cases killed for peacefully demonstrating in favor of free elections and due process. Claims echoed by international human rights groups in the wake of the death of Masa Amini, who died in police custody after being arrested by what's known as the morality police for improperly wearing her hijab. When Masa Amini was killed by the morality police, it just started a spark and people started to be like, okay, that's it, enough is enough. Latifi and the hundreds of volunteers who spent three weeks setting up this demonstration want Chicagoans to know just how dire the situation in Iran is. This is the first time in the world you see a revolution being led by women and men willing to die for them, to fight with them, to stand for their rights, and it's about everyone. And all these flags, they went up on Sunday. If you want to check them out for yourself, very moving to see them up close in person. Very uh, stunning. Uh, they just stretch for, for so long, farther than I can see. Uh, right now, the Chicago Park District has given this group permission uh, to keep these pla flags in place for two weeks. We are live tonight uh, just south of Montrose Harbor. Anthony Ponce, Fox 32, Chicago.